A new drug trial to treat COVID-19 patients is taking place here at the University of Alberta Hospital. The company behind the trial says the first patient was dosed last week. Uh, we are quite excited about uh, the potential here because we've seen it working in humans before. Resverlogic's president and CEO says epibetalone is an oral pill that has been in development for more than 20 years. So we don't alter the human DNA. We just simply turn off the disease-causing genes. McCaffrey says the pill is both antiviral and anti-inflammatory. It's that stealth problem that creates the issue. So around day five in the COVID cycle, those unfortunate few who end up in the hospital start to have anti-inflammatory problems. And so treating with an antiviral, it's not that effective. Our drug does both. He explains that the average stay for COVID-19 patients in hospital is 12 days, while those with underlying conditions stay for an average of 23 days. We do believe we can free up the hospital, maybe completely from COVID patients, which would uh, make a huge difference. ICU doctor Rayan Chowdhury says it's an exciting development from an Alberta-based company. However, it's still early to tell whether the drug will work against COVID-19. He adds, I don't think it will have an impact on this wave. McCaffrey says researchers studying drugs already in production that could potentially treat COVID-19 have ranked epibetalon second on the list. Our drug works on the spike protein of the uh, uh, COVID-19 and therefore our drug works on all variants past, present and future. McCaffrey says the pill would only cost $7. In addition to the University of Alberta site, the trial is also taking place in multiple sites in Canada and Brazil. Resverlogic CEO says that they expect to have all the work done and filed to Health Canada for approval in June. From the University of Alberta in Edmonton, Hiba Kamal Shufi, City News.